Alright, question 13. Jenny earned $3 for every box of food that she delivered. She received an additional $20 for every 10 boxes of food delivered. So how many boxes of food did she deliver if she earned a total of $218? So guys, we need to find out, right? Because one box, she will earn $3. So we need to find out if, let's say, she... Uh, if she were to deliver 10 boxes, she will get 3 times 10, which is $30. But it's not just it, no? Because for every 10 boxes, right, she get an additional $20 of incentive. So that will be $30 plus 20. You will get $50 for every 10 boxes. So now what we need to do, right, is that for this uh, $218, we need to find out how many $50 are there, okay? So, what we need to do, right, is this. We have to take $218, divide by $50. And I need to find out how many uh, $50 are there and what is the remainder. So, the answer it has to be for remainder 18. So, you have 4 sets of $50 plus $18, which is the remainder so how to find the remainder right guys some students are a bit unsure so I will, i'll just show it to you using the calculator so what i'll do is i'll take two one let me turn on first two one eight divided by 50. you can see that you get this number change it to decimal 4.36 okay so what i'll do is that i will write down four which is the quotient so now I will minus 4. Minus away the whole number. I get uh, this 9 over 25 or 0 0.36. Then I multiply by the divisor, okay, which is the uh, $50. So I have a remainder of $18. Okay, so please take note of this. So guys, this 4 here, right? It means that I have 4 sets of $50. 4 groups of $50 and each $50 I have 10, 10 boxes right so this will give rise to 4 times 10 which is 40 boxes and this remaining $18 right you can see that it will go into the individual $3 per box so $18 I divide by 3 I get 6 boxes so all together from down here I get uh, 40 boxes down here, I'll have 6 boxes. So all together, it will be 40 plus 6. It gives me 46 boxes. Okay, so that's the answer.